hey guys welcome or welcome back it's victoria in today's video i'm going to be showing you my daily nighttime routine that i do for my braces i'll be showing you what products and tools i use to keep good oral hygiene so if you're interested stay tuned make sure you like comment and subscribe and let's get into this video so right now i'm just going to go in with my philips sonicare electric toothbrush and just some regular Colgate fluoride toothpaste. So it's recommended that you use an electric toothbrush because it cleans better than a, you know, like a manual toothbrush. And I'm using my Colgate fluoride, fluoride, <laughs> using my Colgate fluoride toothpaste with no whitening agents in it. Okay, so it is very important that you do not use any type of whitening toothpaste or whitening strips or any type of whitening agents while you have your braces on because a portion of your teeth is covered by the brackets. So you do not want to be whitening your teeth while you have your braces on because that's gonna make every area around that bracket whiter than where the bracket is actually placed because it's covering the tooth, if that makes sense. So yeah, it's just best to stay away from any type of whitening agents unless it is directed to you by your orthodontist or your dentist but yeah now i'm just going to show you guys how i brush my teeth as you can see i'm going underneath my brackets and on top of the brackets and i'm also going to be going in the inside of my teeth and really really make sure i hit the gum line because that's very important so a really cool feature that comes with this toothbrush is it notifies you when it's time to move out a specific section of your mouth. So think of it like this. You have four sections in your mouth. You have the upper right, the upper left, the lower left, the lower right. So it will tell you when to brush the lower right, and that's for 30 seconds. Then it'll tell you when to brush the lower left, that's for 30 seconds. Then it'll tell you when to brush the upper right and the upper left. So um, this toothbrush does that by vibrating harder than what it initially does to let you know like okay it's time to move on to the next quadrant of your mouth so i thought that's re it's really cool and it's really helpful it also has a timer a two minute timer on it so you're supposed to brush your teeth for at least two minutes me myself like i said i brush my teeth for way longer than that because i just want to make sure that i'm getting a really good clean but right now i'm just going to go ahead and move on into my water flosser if you have braces and you do not have a water flosser please go get one this thing is a lifesaver and it is just really a really good tool to use so now i'm just going to fill up the tank with some warm water i like my water to be like kind of hot i don't know i feel like if it's hot it's like getting me a better clean or something i don't know i'm weird that's just what i like to do so yeah i'm just going to fill it up and then i'm going to place that back on the tank and i am going to close the top and then i'm going to turn the intensity that it pushes the water out i'm going to turn it up to eight or ten like i don't know when you're first starting off you definitely don't want to go that high because it is very forceful so i've been using this for almost two years now so my teeth can handle it and i've worked my way up to that point um but it is like a very useful tool because it gets a lot of food and plaque and gunk out of your teeth and this is the head that I'm using. It also has bristles on it, so that helps to remove any plaque or any food particles or anything that's in your mouth or inside of your braces. Because let's face it, we all get so much stuff stuck inside our braces when we eat. So yeah, this is a very useful tool to use. And if you don't have one, please, please, please go get one. And like always, I will leave links in the description box so you guys can go check out all of these products that I am using. If you guys are liking what you're seeing so far, go ahead and hit the like button so that way I know that you are enjoying this video. All right, so now I'm about to go in for the second time to brush my teeth. I feel like the first time was just to get like all of the food and plaque and stuff off my teeth. And I feel like this time is just really for me to 
to get the really good clean. All right, so now I'm just about to go in with my Earl B satin floss. I like this floss because it doesn't get snagged on my brackets or any of the ties that I have on in my teeth. So um, yeah, I'm just about to go through and floss my teeth also. Even though I've used a water flosser, I like to go through and also floss it with the regular floss just to make sure I'm getting my teeth really clean. But yeah, how I do this is I don't use the little hook that they gave us. I find it really annoying to use that hook or the threader to thread the floss through my braces I just thread it I just thread my floss through I don't use the threader per se so I'm gonna bring you guys in so you can see exactly what I'm talking about I'm just gonna take the floss and push it um, you know literally behind my brackets and behind my you know behind my wire behind my power chain and just floss my teeth like regular I just find that this is more easier than using the actual threader but I will show you guys how to use a threader if you don't know how to use it but yeah this is just me flossing my teeth all right so here's the floss threaders that I was telling you guys about I use these for like the first I don't know two weeks that I have my braces and then after I seen like how annoying it was, I just stopped using it altogether. But like I said, I will show you guys how to use them. Um, I feel like it's just way easier to use a floss, but hey, to each his own, however you feel more, more comfortable or the most comfortable with flossing your teeth, um, go for it. But here's how you just thread it through like a needle and thread. And then you just take it and you put it through in between the wire and you just pull it through it's you know I guess it's easy but it just takes too long to keep threading it through so that's why I just don't do it all right guys I promise I'm almost done so now I'm just gonna take these gum proxa brushes these little brushes right I'm gonna take them and I'm just gonna use them put a little bit of toothpaste on it and use them to clean my brackets these things are originally to go in between your teeth to clean um you know any bacteria that's lurking or hiding in between your gums or whatever i use it for those reasons also but these are also really good brushes to go and help clean the sides of your brackets where your toothbrush cannot reach so I'm just gonna put a little bit of toothpaste on it and go in between and clean my brackets. So you already know when it's time for the mouthwash to come out, it is almost time to be done. This er this whole thing, my whole brushing my teeth takes me like an hour. I am not kidding. But I'm going to go in with the Crest Pro Health Advanced um, mouthwash and it does have fluoride in it. I make sure my toothpaste and my mouthwash both have fluoride in it. And I'm just going to take a little bit in the cap and I'm just going to go ahead and Switch that around for about 30 seconds to a minute and spit it out. All right, last two things, I swear. So I am wearing rubber bands on my teeth so i'm just gonna take my rubber bands and i want to show you guys how cute my rubber bands are so look at all of these cute little colors that i have i have pink purple green what else orange and they all like neon so yeah i just wanted to show you guys that but yeah i'm just about to take these rubber bands and then i want to put those on and then I'm going to moisturize my lips and that will be the completed mouth <laughs> routine by 
brushing my braces routine i promise and here's the last thing i'm just going to use this aquaphora lip repair um chapstick and i don't know what it is about having braces but it feels like my lips are more chapped now that i have braces so this is a good solution is to make sure your lips are always moisturized and this one particularly works really really well like my lips are like moisturized even from when i go to sleep at night and i wake up in the morning so i hope you guys all enjoyed this video and learned something new and if you got to see some products that you think you might want to try out i highly highly recommend trying out some of the products and like i said check the link in the description box for those products and i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like and comment what your routine is like for your morning or nighttime routines for brushing your teeth with your braces but yeah um uh, thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye